The riding brush we often see is a brush handle connected to the bristles. At the top of the brush handle, there is a cord. This is used to hang the brush. The brush handle is rather straight to make it easy to hold. The brush bristles are the most important. There are two parts to the brush tip. The root, which is the midsection or waist of the brush, and the pointed part, which is called the tip. So how is a brush put together? Below, let's get a basic understanding of brush construction. Please take a look at these pictures I have chosen. There are workers making brush shafts. They carefully choose the wood or bamboo to make the brush handle. These workers are using water basins to choose the fibers for the brush. The fibers are continuously soaked in the basin, rinsed in the water, and arranged into different lengths. These two female workers are putting the handle and the bristles together. Here we can see workers choosing the fibers. They group them into small, medium, and long lengths. What are these two masters doing? Everyone please look. The handle of the brush often has characters or writing carved onto the handle. Perhaps it's the name of the factory where it was made or the name of the brush. So these masters are carving onto the handle of the brush. In this last photograph, these two workers are testing and inspecting the brushes. Okay, now we understand the structure of the brush and the methods of manufacture. Now we can begin our second segment, practice 2.1.